Some dread that Bollywood actor has come out and moved the Supreme Court, taking more time for his surrender. Remember, April 18th is when that window that had been made available to Sanjay that comes to an end. Minakshi joining us with details on this. Minakshi, just give us a sense of what you're picking up on this. Well, yes, uh, just moments back, uh, Sanjay that has moved the uh, Supreme Court. He has sought uh, the top court's intervention uh, because he's seeking for an extension on the four weeks earlier deadline which was imposed by the top court when it had ordered Sanjay Dutt uh, to surrender in four weeks' time. Now, the ground uh, that Sanjay Dutt uh, has taken in this particular plea is that his uh, various pardon pleas, you'll recall uh, just, uh, retired Justice Martin de Carju has written, uh, 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 had written to the president seeking uh, that pardon. So he uh, wants uh, the outcome of that pardon plea to be known. And on that ground, he has invoked the fact, uh, he has invoked that ground, citing that his pardon plea is still uh, pending and therefore he should be allowed more time to surrender. And uh, that, that is the essential uh, primer, uh, primary ground that he has invoked in his plea as he has moved Supreme Court just moments back, uh, seeking the top court's intervention in allowing him an extension on the earlier four weeks that was imposed by the Supreme Court asking Sanjay Dutt to, uh, to surrender. Back to you. So, Minakshi, what exactly happens then from this point onwards? We, we do know that April 18th is when that four-week window comes to an end for Sanjay Dutt. He's come out just two days ahead, moving the Supreme Court. So how are we expecting really this case to move forward once this plea actually comes forward from the Bollywood actor? Well, yes, you rightly pointed out uh, the deadline is fast approaching. Today is the 15th. Uh, so this is an urgent application, uh, urgent plea, which has uh, today been moved in the Supreme Court by Sanjay Dutt and his counsel. So in a short while from now, uh, perhaps over the next couple of days, we will see it uh, uh, play out, whether or not the Supreme Court finds enough merit to consider the plea or whether the court uh, really dismisses it. I mean, that, that will be worthwhile to watch. But for now, uh, what we are bringing to you is the fact that Sanjay Dutt indeed has uh, sought Supreme Court's intervention, invoking uh, the ground that his uh, pardon plea is still pending with the president. Until that plea is disposed of, he should be granted more time and therefore he wants the Supreme Court to really allow him more time to surrender than the earlier four weeks uh, that the Supreme Court had imposed. How this will pan out will be very interesting and worthwhile to watch and it will be only uh, after the Supreme Court has really heard the plea uh, on merits in detail uh, that we will uh, know what opinion the Supreme Court has expressed uh, with, uh, with regards to this particular uh, plea move by Sanjay Dutt wherein he's seeking more time. Back to you.